subject today is about my my 10 years green card Hola Hindi ako na approve guys Papi Yes We're going to the attorney's office to get the papers everything straight that we need to get by our crazy country's immigration system it seems they change the rules every time you send them something so we're gonna have a lawyer look at everything and make sure it's complete so we're um we're going to midlothian virginia to uh Southwest 
Southwest Airlines for the seven trips that we've taken, the lady within 15 minutes gave me all the information. She had proof that we had flown, everything. See? All they have to do is do their job, and they're, they're making us do their job. That's the annoying thing. Imagine uh, uh, one year and two months we waiting for that and you just, uh, the result is just that. It, oh one hour's work they could have had all this information, but they took a, 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 over a year to send it back to make me do everything. Yeah. That's the, that's the annoying part. Exactly. So, so that's happened to, the, that's the, um, Update of my uh, living here in US, guys. So I don't know. So we're going to the attorney now. So we um, we're going to the lawyer, and we gonna ask. I don't know. Is this is really uh, um, what is that? Uh, another amount of money because we have to pay the attorney just to do this. So. And then it took, it, it takes how many, how many months before they sent it back, all the documents and they then... Said, they said it should be done with the Yeah, documents. when it's to be done, yeah, exactly. So it's, it's, it's frustrating, you know, especially that I don't have, and I don't know what will happen after this. Giving me just until January, it's, it's, it's frustrating. So, so we'll update you guys later what's the lawyer will gonna advise us or what is the best thing to do so see you later we'll get it taken care of so ayun guys um tapos na kami doon sa lawyer ayun and then we're going back tomorrow to provide more information more documents kasi yung kailangan daw uh, lahat daw ng uh, what is that bank statement from the very beginning I provide out then ngayon kung mag ay di ba <laughs> kung mapapansin mo iba na yung pinagdadriba namin we rented a giant, uh, giant truck giant truck and hubby is driving <laughs> so we gonna try if we can go home <laughs> so that's our vlog for today so Thank you for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. Pray for us. How <laughs> is it pray for us? This is my first time driving uh what is that? Uh, With him with a big truck. I've driven so, I've driven a big truck before but before but not not not, not now not today. <laughs> So ayun guys, nakauwi na pala kami sa bahay. So gusto ko lang sabihin sa inyo pala na yung binayaran pala namin sa attorney kanina is $700. And then yes, yun nga bukas babalik kami doon para magsubmit ng mga pictures. Magpiprint pa ako ng mga pictures at saka yung sa mga bank statement pa kasi more or more pa dapat yung mga kasubmit kami ng mga bank statement like mga 2 years ago something like that. So ayun. Um, at saka ano pala guys yun um, kaya din kami babalik doon sa attorney kasi gagawa pala yung attorney ngayong gabi ng parang SPE na pipirmahan ko na nagpapahintulot na siya ang magpaprocess ng uh, green card ko so and then yun ang yun ang usapan namin kanina then siguro yung green card ko since lilipat kami ng bahay and sabi niya sa akin is yung green card ko is i-address na lang daw niya doon sa office niya tapos pag dumating daw doon sa bahay niya hopefully talaga na ma-approve ako uh, isi-send na lang niya doon sa amin sa Las Vegas and then later on kami later on kami na ang mag ano mag change ng address online. So, pray for me guys. Sana talaga ma-approve ako para ano, uh, maka-stay pa ako sa US for more vlog sa US. Charing. <laughs> Bunggang-bunggang vlog. So, yun lang po guys. And, yun ang nangyayari sa buong maghapon. So, 
yun lang po guys uh, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe bye